Hello and welcome back. Today we are going to be doing delays using an area effect cloud. Now you could use a timer and have a score, so add one to score, um, and then when score equals 10 do something, when score equals 20 do something else, and then at the end reset the score. Or you can set up a little system like this. Uh, we'll call this commands. Now these are the commands I want to run. They're very exciting commands. I'm going to say one. And I'm going to say two. And we better make that a chain. Oops. Wait, always active. Okay, so I can have a button here and the player comes along and they press the button, but I want a delay. Now, obviously, I don't have a delay. Okay, so let's get rid of that. Let's make ourselves a boink button there. That's not a button, that's a command block. Okay, this one's going to be repeating, so I put a lever on it like I always do. This is going to be the controller. And you only need one of these, so you can pop this down in spawn. So it's always running. Uh, needs redstone, repeat. And we'll have two commands there. And this is going to summon the area effect cloud. Summon cloud. Okay, not the guy from Final Fantasy VII. So these are our commands we want to delay. This is going to be the controller, which once we've made, we leave. Doesn't matter how many delays we want to make, we leave this running. And this is going to be the button that they press to activate this. So what we're going to do is we're going to grab the coordinates of that block. Fill, tab, tab, tab. And I am going to summon an area effect cloud at those coordinates and we're going to want to give it some little tags so first tags let's get some custom tags in there and we'll call it the delay cloud okay after that we will set its age to minus 100 okay we can't if you use duration you don't seem to be able to target it in the mbt so I'm going to use age because we can look at how old something is and we need that later. Okay, so that's going to be the command for now. We're going to come back and make one little change shortly. So let's say done. And now we are going to tag at any entity. Oh dear, what am I doing today? At any entity. Uh, let's say type equals area effect cloud and tag equals delay cloud and we want to check its nbt as well so nbt equals and we're looking at its age age is minus one so we've put minus 100 when we summon it and that will count up to zero and when it gets to zero it should die and so we're going to look at it just before it dies and we're going to give it a tag Activate delay is the tag I'm going to give it. Okay, done. Uh, in fact, now let's just shift home. Let's copy all of that. Go to the next one and paste it back in. Let's remove this MBT and activate delay. So all I've done there is just so I don't have to type out area effect cloud again. Deep, deep, deep. we will execute at our area effect cloud that has been tagged with activate delay so we know it's nbt age is minus one and we are going to run data merge block the block where the cloud is and we are going to put some data in there and we're going to say auto 1b okay so effectively we're going to turn the block on and let's just copy that whole command copy done oh, let's go into this one and exactly the same again but now we're going to turn the command off done okay so our controller is set up and it's running now we just need to summon the cloud so I think 
We've already done that here. Yeah, we've already written that. I'm ahead of myself. Okay, so let's summon the cloud. And what did we put for the age? 100. 20 ticks is a second, so that's five seconds. So fingers crossed. Press the button. Yeah. Okay, so instead of having the button here directly running, we've got a five second delay. Of course, we can change the age to something incredibly long and so long it's useless. Or we could just change it to half a second. See, there's a little tiny delay. It's so quick you can't really notice it. Let's change it to a second. There we go. Okay, but we've got those horrible particles and that is the change we're going to make here. Let's get rid of those. Particle. And what particle do we want to give it? Well, if we give it the particle from a block and we give it from air, uh, well, it's going to be invisible. So it still have particles. They're just invisible now. Let's change this delay to something we can obviously see. Two second delay. Bonk. There we go. We've got a two second delay already. As I say, you only need one of these. And you can summon as many clouds as you like. And don't worry, because when they get to zero, they're going to die anyway. So if I type kill at entity type equals area effect cloud. No entity was found because they die. They kill themselves. So it tidies itself up. Uh, we can have delays all over the place. And we just need this one controller. Okay, that's it. Nice little short one. I think this is quite a handy way of just uh, adding delays to, to things on your map. I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye.